Right, um, so this is going to be part four. I haven't really planned this part. <laughs> um, but I think we will do the, um, interior. Okay. So, first of all, the reason we've got a slight gap at the top is because we've got to get closer to it, basically. We want to get closer inside it, so we've got to bring it bigger on the screen so it looks like we're closer. Um, so what we want to do... So we're going to copy the side again. Then what we're going to do is we're going to move the panel to one side. Make it bigger. Then move it over. Then send that to back. Back that to back. <laughs> that, <laughs> that blue one there. Back to back. Back to back. And you've got to keep the arrows the same size, otherwise it just won't look realistic. Woo! Best you can, it doesn't really matter. Just do the best you can, really. Oh, that made me look like a down the wrong round. That'd be weird. Um, as we get closer, the doors will come closer and everything else will go further away. So what we want to do is we want to make the blue bigger. Then we want to make the doors bigger. And it looks like we're coming closer to it now. we can delete the home thing because we don't need that anymore because we're not going to not want to go back really which we're going to be going into um, the lift send it all to the back make sure the door Actually, we need to make these smaller because what's going to happen otherwise, the door's going to go overlap the panel. So make all the blue things smaller, you can still see them, and then send the door to the back again. Go back. Okay. Job done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So move that over there. Send to back. Back to back. <laughs> back to the back. back, to the back. Back the back. Okay, so you've got that at the back now, and um, you've got everything in place. You've got your arrows in place, which are your indicators. You can get rid of the red thing off now. No point in having them. Back the back. Yeah, the back. Back to the back. Now you look like you're closer. Oh, the doors have got to be open. I want the doors up over there. I want them out of sight, so just drag them across. Stay in the, try and stay in the middle of the screen. You may as well delete the doors there. You can keep the other one there. Alright. Actually, delete both of them. Okay. Yeah, yeah, shut up, Mom. <laughs> Back the back. La la. La la. Okay. There you go. Now you're going into it. Now what you got to do is these arrows on these doors. As you know, as you're probably aware of, no. these doors don't go back far enough. So you need to make the arrows longer, which we can do now because we won't be able to see if it over if it, um, if it um, comes out of screen or anything. Won't really matter. We've got to just get the doors out of the way so they go out of the way. So they open like that, and you can have them overlapping a bit if you really want. Actually, well, it's best for them to go back as far as possible. Not too far, otherwise you can't change the arrows later because you won't be able to see them. So just make them go very far back so it looks the same as on that page. So you're getting close to it, basically. Um, that panel needs to adjust. So 
I say that? No. Dabba 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 dabba. There you go. Okay, so now we have five left. Gonna go up. Um, what we need to try and do is we need to try and make it skip. So when we click, um, somehow we need to we need to basically make it so that when we go into it, it's um, doesn't go onto the um, down wall. So what we need to do is we need all of the slides. We need links instead of using the arrow keys. So you're going to have to have a next button down the bottom here. Yeah, so that you can go to the next chapter. No, Mom! <laughs> Only took me about ten times. Slide four. Okay. This one also needs to have a hyperlink to slide four. Oh, your computer lets out a lot of ammo. So F5, I click up. Click next, and we go into it. Oh, the arrow has disappeared. Let's go to home. Let's go down this time. Uh, and then it's going weird. Oh, we've got the doors to need to start with previous. For some reason, they're not starting with previous. That door needs to start with previous. And then start after previous. <coughs> that needs to start after previous. Yeah, there we go. Okay, click F5. Up. Door will open. Uh, 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 down. Doors open. Okay, we're going down. Next. I knew all that this morning when I was walking the dog. So we have that. We don't need that there. I don't know why that was there. Okay, we're going to go down to make things simple. And next is going to be in going into it. Okay, we'll do the interior next time. And, um,. Oh, that, 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 that anyway, we'll do the um, we'll do the intern. We're gonna do the internal bit next time. Um, okay. All this is is just going into it and perfecting things, making them all alike. And on two, which is the up one, we need to make those arrows go a bit further because we haven't done that yet. There we go. We'll go really far. Make it even further. Get the arrows out really far. There you go. So now we click up, going up, home, we click down, going down. We can go straight to there. And there we go, that's all we're going to do so far. So that concludes this part of the tutorial. Bye.